What's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning in to another episode of On Track. I'm your host, Mike Lotta, and our guest today is Jim from the band Paper Covers Rock. But I guess it's just you, so do you, you can go by Jim or Paper Covers Rock, whatever you, whatever, whatever, whatever we want to put that's probably going to come up like right here sometime soon. I'll say Paper Covers Rock. Paper Covers Rock. Even though when I, when I refer to myself, I do say like the band, but even though... Okay, so paper covers plural, rock. There you go. Stick, yeah. So uh, again, we're going to get into the list of questions we ask everybody. How'd you start playing music? Okay, well, I was in a band with my brother and a good friend of ours. And then after a while, it just you know, went downhill to the point where like no one wanted to practice anymore. <laughs> and I still wanted to make music. So I'm like, I don't really feel like relying on anyone else. So I just started my own solo thing. Now you were telling me uh, you were telling me earlier that when you play, you don't normally play acoustic. You play with a drum machine. You yeah, that's right. I have a, a drum machine that I program all the music into, like all the drum beats, and then it also has a synthesizer that plays along with it. So it'll play like bass, guitar, piano, violins, whatever you want to play it. So usually, like if you heard something, it'll it'll be like a whole band together. So Plus me it, playing guitar. Was it weird doing it just acoustic today, or? I don't know. Some, I'll, I'll play an open mic where they can't even like uh, hook up anything, but uh, I, I thought it'd be pretty cool. Just now we're play. we're about to get into the song uh, "Pass Right By." Yeah. Now, can you tell us a little bit about that? Okay, "Pass Right By." It's a song about um, which most of my songs about a girl I've dated at one point in my life. Of course. And uh, to the point where she just kind of envisioned me as some sort of like like burden on her, I guess, which which made me realize like what the hell is going on here. And uh, but you know like I still kept a kept a optimistic uh, uh, mindset that you know everything's gonna be okay. All right, all right. Well, here it is. Enjoy. together 
Real men know that getting tested is the way to take care of their families. That's why real men wear gowns. For a list of the tests you need, go to AHRQ.com. ¿Cuáles son los números que importan en tu vida? Tu salario. Tu aniversario de bodas. Los cumpleaños de tus hijos. Si tienes diabetes, el número más importante es tu A1C. El A1C es el número que le dice a tu doctor si tu diabetes estuvo bajo control los últimos tres meses. Porque si tu diabetes no está controlada... Uh... Pregúntale a tu doctor cuál es tu A1C. Pregúntale. Pregúntale. Él lo sabe y tú debes saberlo también. Únete a la campaña Ahora Sé Mi A1C. Thanks for coming back. I'm still your host, Mike Lada, here with Paper Covers Rock. Yeah. Not Jim anymore, it's just Paper Covers Rock. Um, what are your influences, man? Uh, actually, I only have one main influence. Mm. Uh, this band, Me Without You. They're like... Never heard of them. I actually went... It, it was a coincidence. I, I came over them. I went to a concert to see a band who ended up canceling, and they took their spot. And I'm just like, this band's amazing. And then I bought one of their CDs, the CD called AB Life, which just like was encapsulated my whole life. Have they been out for a life. while or they just got a couple CDs uh, out? I think since maybe 2002, 2000, so something like that. fairly new. Yeah, and um, so it encapsulated like my whole life, at, at least at that point in time. So it just influenced me to actually start writing music. Because at first I, I wanted to make electronic music, like club music. I want to go out to the club, you know, I want to party. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and, uh, and so anyway, uh, Enough of the club music, yeah, let's go. No. Yeah, no, it, it influenced me uh, a lot to just start yeah. writing more more personal things like that. So when you're writing a song, like, what what goes through your head? What, what starts the process? Is it, do you do figure out the guitar first, or do you do lyrics and then the guitar? I don't know. It, it's, it's more of a mixture of both of those. Uh, sometimes it'll be guitar first, sometimes it'll be the lyrics first, but most of it I see it more as therapy. I don't even see it as like, oh, I'm going to go somewhere with this music or anything like that. It's yeah. more of a hobby, it's just to get things off my mind, just more of a... Yeah, more of a therapeutic type of uh, type of uh, situation. Cool, cool. Well, uh, enough talking about the music. Let's uh, get right back to it. So, there you go. I've met 
that I'm so sorry for the things I've done I just hope you can forgive me again second of this This is the way it should have always been And I awaken to her in my arms That skin is as cold as ice She's trying to ruin my life Get me to the hospital Excuse me, what time are you guys leaving? We're gonna rob your house tonight. Don't you wish there were warnings to protect you from life's risks? With diabetes, there is one. It's called A1C, a simple blood test that helps measure your risk of serious complications. Learn more at diabetesa1c.org. Underneath everything we are, underneath everything we do, we are all people, connected, interdependent, united. And when we reach out a hand to one, we can influence the condition of all. That's what it means to live united. What's going on, everybody? Mike. Jim, sorry, paper covers rock. It's fine. Now we're, we're about either to, or. Yeah, either or. All right. We're about to hear House on the Hill and uh, Wolves Get Paid. Now you say there's a story about Wolves Get Paid. Yeah, there's a story behind that. It's actually like, I wouldn't say it's, it's quite of a long story, but I was uh, in a relationship where it came to, a, I wouldn't say an abrupt end, but it was just a complete disaster by the end. It happens. And uh, had I been able to travel back in time, I would... Uh, rather get e eaten by wolves than, than go back out with this uh, specific person. I, I don't know what to say to that. You know, I, yeah. mean, I mean, the end of the song ends with, I have teeth in my skull, and, uh, but, it's, but it's okay because, you know, I'm, I'm out of this relationship. It was a complete, complete disaster. Well, it's a good song, so uh, sit back, relax, microwave a TV dinner, and enjoy. Are lining the streets in my commute. It's 
it's almost endless There'll be no roads for miles An extra room in my mattress I'll spend my nights sipping gin And my days would be the same This was a party at the house on the hill Cooking food over a fire And the news it does not reach me There'll be no sins to confess And no condemning any actions weather would be perfect and no need to look your best all up at the house on the hill living so far away I've never felt more alive you can write me some letters but I doubt that they'll arrive you can make yourself feel better if you just left that city behind and hung out at the house on the hill Stay with me at the house on the hill You can make yourself feel better If you just left this city behind And hung out at the house on the hill Yeah, I'm headed towards that house on the hill Sore throat in the morning I've had better days Days when I wasn't insane Days when I was okay Again, these have twisted me up In this little trap It's not one that I've set It's not anything I appreciate Though I've done this to myself There isn't anyone to blame Although I loved playing that game And now I'm finished with it I will myself over just to get again while she's still with him and he's not me Walk into the lights, I walk out of this place. You won't see a trace if you just give me some pointers. Like downing a bottle of pills and getting one way ticket to Christ. Transferring to Hinsdale for the night. Would you be surprised? Or just tear out my lungs and feed them to the wolves? This will be better off than you. And far less depressed, don't let me hold you. Back. Don't let me chirp this tune You have the rest of your life ahead That when you're dying to end Take what's at stake and stick it through my heart Bleed all this out, oh just make it go away I am sick of these days like I am sick of this face I'll be better spent alone without myself This is you not know, my life and you're just with my head Make up your mind or just hang me out to dry my plate is full of food and my life is filled with And my place is getting hungry I'll just have them take care of it I sit here now, I am thinking out loud I don't even recognize my own face So I'm sure this is all a dream There's a wolf at my leg and there are teeth in my skull Yet there's no signs of you Which means I'm still better off
No, what'd she say? She said whatever. No, she says that all the time. What's that? Hello? I'm on the phone. Mom, I'm on the phone! Hello? I'm on the phone. Who's this? It's me. I'm on the phone. Mom. Oh, you're on the phone. <laughs> all right. Sorry! Sorry. Sorry. Okay, anyway. Who are you talking to? Kelly? Mom. All right. You don't have to be perfect to be a perfect parent. There are thousands of teens in foster care who would love to put up with you. Ah, it's a great day, isn't it? Yeah. Too bad your boat's gonna sink at 11.05. Don't you wish there were warnings to protect you from life's risks? With diabetes, there is one. It's called A1C, a simple blood test that helps measure your risk of serious complications. Learn more at diabetesa1c.org. Your 
lower in the eyes so you can't see what we're doing like Jesus Christ he saved you from me now all I have left is this idea in my mind it's stuck in my brain please make it go away I give anything to anyone to stop this spin to control these legs to make you mine you will be mine You just heard Five a Day by Paper Covers Rock. Now, uh, is there a place where anybody can go to listen to your music? They can go to myspace.com slash papercoversrock or papercoversrockmusic.com. Okay. You can go to those two places, I guess. Now, besides music, do you have any other hobbies? Anything you want to tell the people out there watching? Uh, I'm, I'm a complete nerd, I would say that, that for that much. I, in my spare time, I try to read as much philosophy as possible. and. Uh, I'm just trying to make my way through school. My aspire to be a law student within that's the cool. next year or so. Where are you going to school? Uh, Northern Illinois University. Right, that's cool. Any place after that or just stopping there? Out of the Midwest, that's for sure. You want to get I out wanna, of there? I want to leave this place I'm standing in right now. And this Did whole, I do well, something? Well, not, not actually this place, but I mean this, Did I this, say this, something this area. No, you didn't say anything right, wrong. Good. But I want to leave. I want to leave the Midwest. I've aspired to do that for a long, Any very, specific very long reason? Time. Just, just, just want to get Get out. Just want to get out. Right. Now, start over. Where have you played shows? Like, where, where around the area have you played? Um, played. I mean, you know, I don't really try and go out and look for shows or anything like that. I only play a show if someone asks me to because I don't really have time to go out looking for shows. Like, mm. it's like some artists do, but you know, anywhere, pretty much, someone asks me to play, I'll play it. I'm down for playing. Now, if you could have one person call you up and be like, hey, I need you to open for me. Right now, into the camera, wherever camera we're at, camera two, let's go there. Say into camera two, whoever you want to call you up right now and play a show. Okay, if, if Zach Taylor had a band of his own, I would want him to call me up and tell me, come on, play a show with me. We'd have to give Zach a night off for him to do that, though. You guys would have to do it. Yeah, all right, we, we just might, we just might. Cool, anything else, anything else you want to say to anybody out there right now? No. Nothing I could say on the show that uh, isn't uh, <laughs> right. profane or, uh, or very awkward. Well, no. thanks for coming on. Paper Covers Rock, Jim. Mike. Check them out. MySpace.com slash Paper Covers Rock. And remember, out there, everybody, if you're wearing a bandana, you're just a die job away from being Brett Michaels. <laughs>